हेलो गाइस वेलकम एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल जेबीआर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल सो हेलो एवरीवन नाउ इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज 21.2 फ्रॉम सम नंबर 7 for the previous one that means 1 to 6 please check the description box the link will be there and for the other exercise please visit our website the link of the website is in the description box okay so here in sum number 7 find the median for the following distribution okay so first you have to make column so first one is your marks second one your frequency that means number of student and you know that the last one is cumulative frequency okay so first here you have to write down the marks here so first one here 20 then 70 then 50 after that 60 okay 20 70 50 then 60 next one here 75 90 and last one here 40 okay so 20 70 50 60 75 90 40 so now do one thing first first you have to arrange this marks into ascending order okay first you have to arrange this mark in ascending order so first one will be 20 so just it is this one so first one here 20 after that it 40 then next one 50 then 60 70 75 90 okay so you have to write down the numbers in ascending order so the frequency for the 20 that one equal to 8 now 40 that one equal to 12 next one 50 that one equal to 18 then 6 12 9 5 now next thing you have to find out the cumulative frequency i hope you know that uh, so first one will be here 8 now second one to find out the cumulative frequency for the second one multiply 8 with 12 okay you know that so 8 plus 12 it will be 20 then 20 plus 18 it's 38 38 plus 6 it's 44 44 plus 12 it's 56 56 plus 9 it's 65 65 plus 5 that one equal to 70 okay that means here n equal to 70 which is an even number so for the even number the formula for the median so for even number the formula for the median is half then here n by 2th term plus n by 2 plus 1th term okay so half n by 2th term means 35th okay 35th term so here 3 5 35th term and here 36th term so now you have to find out the value of 35th term so as here up to 8 here the value is 20 up to 20 the value is here 40 and up to 38 that means from 21 to 38 okay from 21 to 38 here the value is 50 that means 25th term is 50 26th term also 50 30th term 50 35th term 50 36th term it's 50 so in that case here write down half into 35th term means 50 plus 50 okay 100 so your answer is 50 okay your answer is 50 now move on to the next problem sum number 8 sum number 8 so here in sum number 8 Calculate the mean and median for the following distribution. Okay, mean and median both. So, first write down here the number. The numbers are 5, 10, 15. They are in ascending order. So, 20, 25, 30, after that 35. Next one here, frequency. Frequency 1, 2, the next one 5, then 6, the 3, then 2, then 1. Okay. Now next one cumulative frequency it's very easy so 1 it's 1 1 plus 2 3 3 plus 5 8 8 plus 6 14 14 plus 3 17 17 plus 2 19 19 plus 1 20 okay now next thing you have to find out also the fx okay fx means multiplication of f this one here f 
and this one the number is your x so that means you have to multiply these two 5 into 1 you have 5 then 10 into 2 20 15 into 5 75 20 into 6 120 25 into 3 75 3 into 2 60 35 into 1 35 okay now find out the addition or summation fx so the summation fx will be 390 also find out the summation f that one equal to 20 okay so now your first question that is mean mean equal to summation fx divided by summation f summation fx 390 by 20 0, 0, cancel out so your answer is 19.5 okay now here in the cumulative frequency the last digit is n you know that so as here n equal to an even number okay again n equal to even number so for the median you know the formula half then 20 by 2 th term that means 10th term so here the 10th term from 5 to 20 all the values are 10 so 10th term plus 11th term and the values are here half into 10 plus 10 okay so here sorry uh, sorry for that one not this one extremely sorry for this one uh, it will be here uh, this one as here 10th term 10th term means here so from the cumulative frequency not the fx from the cumulative frequency here the 10th term then up from 8 to 14 here the value is 20 okay that means the value of 10th term it's 20 11th term also 20 okay so half into 40 your answer is 20 okay mean equal to 19.5 and median equal to 20 so sum number 8 done now move on to sum number 9 in sum number 9 the daily wages in rupees of 19 workers are here 41 so 41 21 38 27 35 in this way there are total 19 numbers are there so do one thing first write down all the numbers in ascending order so first one here 21 then 23 25 26 27 28 29 again 29 30 31 again 31 35 35 38 41 after that 42 45 47 53 total 19 numbers are there that means odd one so as they are the odd number so median equal to the formula you know that n plus 1 th term that means 20 by 2 its 10th term so here 10th term 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so 31 is the 10th term so your answer is 31 okay now next part it's lower quartile okay so lower quartile here the formula for the lower quartile suppose this one is q1 so the formula is n plus 1 by 4 so as here n equal 19 so 20 by 4 that means here fifth term and here the fifth term is 1 2 3 4 so 27 is the fifth term now next one upper quartile here the formula is 3 into n plus 1 by fourth term okay that means 3 into 5 here the 15th term so 10 11 12 13 14 15 so 41 so 41 is your answer okay now next one the last one interquartile range okay interquartile range that is here q3 minus q1 which one q3 this one upper quartile and this one q1 lower quartile so q3 minus q1 41 minus 27 that one equal to 14 okay so 14 is your answer okay done now next one sum number 10 so guys if you like my video please please share this video and please subscribe my channel so here from the following frequency distribution okay from the following frequency distribution so first write down the columns here variates here the frequency here cumulative frequency so 15 18 20 
27 and 30 next one here 4 6 8 9 7 8 6 cumulative frequency 4 4 plus 6 10 10 plus 8 18 18 plus 9 27 then 34 42 and 48 okay so n equal to here again even number so it's very easy to find out the median half then 48 by 2 means what 24th term okay 24th term plus 25th term so 24th term that means 18 to 27 so here the value is 22 so 22 plus 22 your final answer is 22 okay now next one lower quartile you know the formula for the lower quartile that means q1 here the formula is n by 4 as here n equal to even number so for the lower quartile the formula is n by 4 for odd number that means the previous one here the lower quartile is n plus 1 by 4 remember this one okay for even it is only n by 4 for odd it will be n plus 1 by 4 so n by 4 term means here 12th term because sorry uh, n by 4 as 48 okay 48 by 4 that one 12th term so 12th term here the value is 20 by 20 because from 10 to 18 from 10 to 18 the value is 20 so 12th term is lie between 10 to 18 so your answer is 20 now upper quartile q3 formula is 3n by 4 okay that means here 3 into 48 by 4 36 term okay so 34 to 42 your answer is here 27 okay again find out interquartile range q3 minus q1 27 minus 20 that is 7 okay 27 minus 20 that one equal to 7 it's a very easy problem okay now let's move on to the last problem from this exercise here some number 11 for the following frequency distribution find the median again find out the median so here the variate so variate then frequency and then cumulative frequency 25 it's 3 frequency 31 it's 8 34 it's 10 40 15 45 10 then 48 9 50 uh, here 6 60 here 2 cumulative frequency 3 3 plus 8 11 then 21 21 plus 15 36 46 55 61 63 okay so n equal to odd number so median median equal to 63 plus 1 by 2 so 32th term 32th term means 21 to 36 value equal to 40 so median equal to 40 now lower quartile you know the formula n plus 1 so 64 by here uh, 64 by 4 okay uh, 64 by 4 and that one equal to here 64 16th okay 16th term so here the answer is 16th term that one equal to here 34 so 34 okay 34 is your lower quartile now upper quartile q3 q3 here 3 into n plus 1 okay so that means here 3 into here 64 by 4 so here 40 uh, this one 48th term and 48th term means 46 to 55 here answer is 48 so 48 that is your answer